Hello students and welcome. I'm Professor P, your guide to the world of technology and your professor of business and data here at Tulsa Community College. I want you guys to get ready to dive into our upcoming video where we're going to be exploring our course materials and providing any needed updates and clarifications for our course. So without anything else, let's go ahead and jump in and get started. Well, students, in this video we'll be talking about your learning module one. Now, in this very first module, our journey through the world of business and data analytics, in this module, we're going to dive into the nuances of the information age. We're going to look at the key differences among data, information, business intelligence, and knowledge. You're going to learn how these elements are interconnected, the foundation to modern business strategies. We're also going to cover systems thinking about the vital role of management information systems in enhancing our business communications. Now this module is going to set the stage for your understanding on how strategic thinking and information systems are interwined in competitive business landscapes. Every one of our modules in this class really scaffold together. So as we work through modules one through modules eight, the materials in modules one will be the basis of what we begin to learn in module two and so forth. So if you skip a module or do poorly, you really need to go back and make sure you study, read, and watch the videos to get a good, better understanding before you move on to the next modules. Now, the learning material in this module will take about two hours and 10 minutes to three hours and 14 minutes to complete. Uh, that is the textbook itself plus the lecture videos. Uh, an average student completed in about two hours. A student that needs a little extra time should be three, but that should be the time frame for the activities of learning that you'll be doing. Now, for the activities that are assignments from your case study to your exams, you do need to do an additional amount of time. Typically, you're going to spend about 6.5 hours on any given module in this classroom. Now, module one is going to focus on two chapters. Chapter one, the information age, and chapter two, competitive strategies analysis and the temporary nature of competitive advantages and SWOT analysis. I know this is a lot of words you don't know yet, but as you get into it, you're going to get really in-depth understanding of each of these things. Now, we are in traditional grading scales, zero to or 100%, uh, you know, what, 90 to 100 is an A, 89.9 to a 80 is a B, and so forth. Now, you're going to be great on a variety of things. Uh, make sure you get in there, you do your pre-quiz. The pre-quiz is a pass-fail model, meaning that you must take the pre-quiz to get the points. Uh, that is hand-graded. After that, you're going to watch the lecture series. The lecture videos are, have no points associated with them, but they can be tested on on the final exam. From there, you're going to do your case study. Your case study is a 1,000 to 1,500 words essay that is also uploaded to the discussion board and requires interaction with your fellow classmates. And after that, you're going to take your project for your Power BI, which is an instruction on how to download, install. The Power BI project has no points associated with it, but please remember that that does scaffold over the eight modules. And in your capstone module, all the materials you learned about Power BI does become a final comprehensive project that is four points that you must complete to complete the class. Now, as you go through, make sure you check out the videos. If you have any questions, comments, concerns, let me know. You're going to really enjoy this. Things like SWOT analysis really focuses on some of the big key pieces of business. And you're going to learn a basic understanding of all business and data analytics. And it will grow much more in depth as we process through. All right, guys, if you need me, let me know. Otherwise, enjoy Module 1.